Just like the years flying by, it's hard to believe, but summer break is over for some school districts. Wayne 15's Michael Kuhn kicks off our week-long series of live reports this morning from Wabash High School. Good morning, Pat and Alyssa, and good morning, Wabash City Schools. It's about time to get up and get going for the first day of school for the 2019-2020 school year. We are live at Wabash High School with Superintendent Jason Callahan. He joins us this morning on First News for our back-to-school coverage. Thanks for being here with us. First of all, tell us what makes your district so special. Yeah, Michael, we, uh, we really believe it's our people. Uh, we say people before programs, and uh, we have wonderful people that build relationships relationships with kids and all our stakeholders um, but aside from that I think it's our our vision of um, we have a vision statement of building a legacy of opportunity for all we want to do big things at Wabash City Schools uh, across the district um, not not just small opportunities but big opportunities that are going to have generational impact and for all students not just a small segment of students so we want to make sure that we reach them all uh, from the smallest of kids to to the kids that are leaving us and going out into the world and so um, it's it's really that uh, vision statement that drives us you see all over the school the statement written the Apache way tell us a little bit about that and how you put that into action yeah so the Apache way really started about a 10 years ago and it was really about this idea of dedicating ourselves to doing things the right way not the easy way but doing things the right way and I remember I was I was the high school principal at the time and uh, really uh, the kids always joked around like hey Mr. Callahan it's the Apache way right uh, but finally it became part of our DNA and and you'll see that across our district um, it's really about just doing things the right way uh, in everything that we do and every day what do you have going on this year that you're excited about? Maybe that's new and, and you want people to know about. Yeah, so uh, really it's an expansion of that programming uh, that we've been doing. Um, again, our pillars are relationships, innovation, academics, uh, wellness and safety, and, and global citizenship. And so one of the things we're really excited about is we hired a director of global citizenship this year, Sarah Delgadillo, um, and she is really building out our student exchange. So here in about a week and a half, we're going to host 17 uh, Chinese middle schoolers here at Wabash and uh, and then in the spring we're going to host about 40 students from Japan and we'll we'll be able to send 20 of our kids to the uh, uh, 2020 uh, Tokyo Summer Olympics and so we're very excited about growing that diversity in small rural Indiana.